All right, what is up, guys? Professor Akali here, bringing you the Season 8 Akali Jungle. Guys, today we're going to be seeing, is Akali Jungle viable? You know, you have Dark Seal now. It's this amazing rune that stacks up really well in the jungle, um, way better than in lane, at least. So we're going to be seeing in this video, how good is it? Can it snowball? And just, is it something you should be running in your rank games? Personally, I'm not so sure. I was a little iffy on the last season, Akali Jungle. But it seems a lot stronger just based off of all the things that have been changed lately. So, um, yeah, we're going to just settle once and for all. Is it good? Should you do it? Um, and, yeah, let's get the E reset right here. We're going to be just abusing um, our E resets left and right in the jungle. And I think around level 3 or 4, we'll try to go for a gank. But we'll see what happens. Obviously, um, jungle is a bit different from lane. It's all just, you know, versus it's like PvE instead of PvP. Um, so what we're going to do is just keep on autoing and running. We don't want to get hit by the camp unless we're attacking him back. Um, and sometimes you can avoid uh, you can avoid taking damage or at least for momentarily while you swing at him again. And 410. Okay. Going on my way here. They're both really low, but dude, this guy is, this guy is extremely low. I'm going to get a point in W. Alright. Oh, he missed. He missed. You're dead, dude. I hate you. I was so close to taking that. It wouldn't have been first blood anyways, but whatever. Okay, let's uh, let's go over here now. Um, and I guess we can count on... Oh, that is unfortunate. I'm going to pretend to leave, though, and just go right back in. Yeah, we're going right back into this. I'm assuming Cam Camille didn't have a ward there. Should be fine. We have smite available. This is going to be interesting. Whoops. I have to take this quick. I have smite. I'm confident in myself. I can W over the wall. Nice, steal that away. I'm gonna auto him, but I'm gonna keep running. And we're completely fine there. I think it's worth stealing that. Um, there's no way to know, because if I die because I didn't have flash, then it's not worth, but I think it's worth for now. I'm trying to keep it up here. Oh man, rest in peace, rest in peace. <laughs> A little bit of flame going on bot lane. Okay, let's uh, just push this in right now. Or, sorry, not push this in. I'm so used to saying that. Let's clear out this jungle camp, and then I think we're going to recall. Um, against a Mumu jungle, I don't think we need red smite. Um, it's usually going to be blue smite as a Kali, because you just want to like enhance your level 6 ganks. That's really what it comes down to, I think. Um, it, it's always been what it comes, what it came down to playing Akali Jungle. It's just trying to get your level six ganks to work um, because of how like ridiculously strong they are. So I think that's what we're gonna aim for. We're just gonna aim for the blue smite so we can enhance, you know, get that slow for the gank. And I think that's when we're gonna start snowballing really hard. But I mean, as you guys saw top lane, there's always gonna be opportunities usually to get. Oh shoot! Please don't die. Uh, anyways, there's always going to be opportunities to just, like, get these kills. You just have to be seeking them. I think that's what a lot of junglers don't do. They just tunnel on the jungle camps when a free kill is literally just, like, five seconds away. Alright. Put the red, uh, red onto both of them. Ah, oh, damn it. Missed the E reset barely. What is going on? Clicks are terrible. Doesn't matter. I want to auto this really quick to heal. And then we'll do this. Uh-oh. Mumu is at level 4 with 24 CS, and we have 28, so I think we're a little bit ahead of him. Damn it, no E resets, this is not good. Yeah, I'm just gonna smite this one. There we go. He's pinging for a gank? I'm on my way, but I got nothing, dude. I'm level 4 Akali. Here, go here, go here, go here. I'm gonna give it five more seconds. Oh, okay, well. Oh, we got him. Wait, give me that Dark Harvest stack. Yes, he has no Dark Harvest, right? He can't steal him away from me. Hell yeah, dude. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna take this wave to his attacks. Damn it. Give me this one. Hell yeah, I'm gonna tax the crap out of him. By the way, this is, you know, ranked on the NA server. I'm sure it's the same on every server. The tax is real. Um, it's probably worse on the EU servers, but let's do, let's do this. What's Pantheon's health looking like? I'm on my way. Okay, 
Get him, dude. What are you doing? Come on, dude. You're six. You're six. You're six. Come on. That was a great ult. I think he's going to get the kill. Nice, dude. Uh-oh. Oh, fail play. Fail play. All right. I'll Q auto again. We're six so early. I took two tower shots for some reason. I have no clue what caused me right there to just stop moving. I think I may have gone invisible, which is like a little glitch Akali has, where you when you go invisible, it just cancels your last action. Uh, but anyways, we got the revolver now, so that's good. That's really good. Pick up some potions. Just, you know, why not? We In case we need them in a fight. And right now it's 5-5. Five to five. And I gotta say, guys... Um, I mean, I think that our team comp is just so far superior. Um, Pantheon, I don't know about that, but he's doing well. So he's doing his job. He's supposed to win lanes. Um, he's got Airy. He's supposed to really just crush his lane. Pantheon's an early game champion, I think. Um, and just the fact that we have Yasuo, Alistar with a Twitch. Oof, that's going to be so good. Just take this really quick. All right, and now I'm going to go over here. And we have a few options. Do we go blue? Do we go mid or we go bot? I think. I'm kind of thinking mid. I'm thinking mid right now. I'm thinking mid. Come on, dude. Go in. Uh oh. Oh, man. Holy, holy, holy crap. Please. I'm actually gonna lift. What? Oh, wait. You're dead, dude. You are dead. Not me, baby. Not me. It's all you. Holy crap, we lived through that. Um, <laughs> There's no way this is worth it. There's no way I died to Jace. Okay, we're good. We're good. Damn, that was insane. Um, I guess just wait. Use our E once we get the reset. Or not. <laughs> It's all good. We have 58 Dark's Harvest stack so early. It's really good. And auto once, and then press E. Always want to get the heals going in lane. Oh, I'm coming. Jace is on his way. No, 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 I don't think he is. I think I can go through lane here. Is this warded is the question. Can you, can, you go, can you go for that ward, please? No? Okay. Well. Whoa, holy crap. Are we tanking this? No, we're not. Please, no. I hate you, minions. It's all the minions' fault, dude. I think I would have barely lived if I didn't get barraged. That's all good, though. Um, Once again, I mean, we just got a double, right? Or... Yeah, we got double. Okay, good. We're killing it right now. We're killing it, guys. Um, and we could go for Runic Echoes. I mean, we don't have enough for a Gunplate. So I think we could just go for Runic Echoes right here. Um, Revolver is really important just for that single target burst. But Bilgewater, not so much. Part of the reason Bilgewater is good is the sustain in lane. Uh, it's a very unique situation right now. But I think Runic Echoes would be better than Bilgewater. Rest in peace, dude. He's got no blue, though. Ooh, this could be free. I'm seeing it. I can see it. It's flashing before my eyes. Damn it. Nice, nice, nice. Who's their top laner? Camille? Alright, well then... For real? Really? That, that just happened. It, that really just happened. I mean, okay. Alright. I'll accept it. I just... I didn't think Jinx level 7 would do 400 damage to me. Dude, Sheik is missing her. Oh my. Such good, like... So many knockups, like multi-person knockups, but... It looks like it's actually gonna lead to something really good. Okay, so we'll just say it was a bait. 
until uh until Pantheon could get over there and just clean the floor or wipe the floor with them rather. Dude, we're doing really good though. Four, five and two. We need to get Gunblade ASAP now. Um, but we're really strong regardless without it. It's just. I think we can kill this guy. I'm gonna ult onto a minion and then blue smite him. W to get close to him and then blue smite him. There we go. Hell yeah. And give me that Dark Harvest stack right there too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And we have 86 stacks so far. Just gonna keep track of it. I think 150 is when things get insane. Right? I'm pretty sure. Um, I'm gonna read it. Once we get 150, yeah. Once we get 150, it lasts pretty much until we use it. I mean, six minute cooldown. There's pretty much no situation in which we're not gonna be using it immediately. But I guess we're going for this turret. Ouch. I actually have zero defensive stats. <laughs> the Hexa Flash, that's funny. Uh, I guess we're going. Oh, nice. I think we're going to get it. Mumu is over here, so nothing to be worried about, really. I think I'm just going to start doing a power farm. Nice, good E resets. Camille's going to get away, I believe. We could go for a play. I think this is just going to be Jinx. It's just going to be... Okay, it's going to be bot lane. It's going to be bot lane. This is a great opportunity to catch them off. They're half committed on both ends. Half committed on both ends is never good for them. Damn, dude. Okay, Dark Harvest. Good work, Dark Harvest, because uh, that, was, that was some damage right there. Wait. They'll die. It's okay. We can take it the hit maybe. I mean, they're recalling, but if we can take the turret, that'd be good. Just anything. Um, we almost have enough for the Gunblade as well. We're gonna get some gold off of this. I think we like 150 total or something. Hell no, what are you guys doing? There's no chance we take that, unless they were like doing Rift Herald and assuming we'd recall. But that would be some Korean level plays to know that we didn't have vision and that it's not happening. Mumu's going first, followed by Jace. Those are two people I don't want to mess with. However... Yeah, I knew that was a dumb idea. <laughs> uh, it, was, it was a good attempt at a 2v5, but... I think I should have kept running. But, I mean, I was down for it. I stopped. I was feeling it, but I mean, that's the type of play you should make only when you have a gun blade and maybe like 10 more kills. Well played, well played. Airy on Camille, huh? I mean, I guess I can see it, but it's so weird how melee champions, even after the nerf, are taking it. It's really strange to me. Um, let's go for the doubles, though. Yeah, they're going to take that. I can't even avoid it. I might just do like a very full jungle clear right here just to get to 150 stacks. Yeah, I think we should do that. We've we've had a lot of fun farming, but or fighting, but I think it's time to just do one quick uh, quick clear. Let's do a Runic Echo, so it shouldn't be taking too long at all. Okay. Do you auto eat this? I don't even want to waste energy. My team's fighting. I might have to go fight, dude. But we're so close to 150. That's when it's like the beginning of the end for them. That's when it's like literally a ticking time bomb. Because anything past 150, and like you're gonna start doing insane amounts of damage. All right, 120, 120. I think we're just gonna keep farming until 11 at least. Don't don't go for blue because I'm gonna have to smite that away from you. What the heck? I think Ezreal was going for a random blue steal. Oh, well, it's time to fight, I think. I'm just going to smite it just so I can get there faster. But I do want blue buff. It's going to be really important. We have two old stacks available. We can win a fight. Hold on. Oh, he smited, he smited. 
Looks like nothing's gonna happen here. I guess we could just go back and go for uh, sword boots. We're gonna be going for the AP one shot build this game. Just go for like a lich bane and a sword and sword boots. Since we don't have to like, we don't have the responsibility of like split pushing anything. We're literally the jungler. You know, no one cares about the. No, no, I'm just kidding. Jungle mains. I used to be a jungle main. Don't roast me. Uh, but seriously though, we can do whatever we want as a jungler. And if that includes one shotting their jinx, you know, so be it. Fill that up. What? How did he? What just happened? Why did he not die when I queued him? Also, why is Alstar just dying like that? I don't get it. Okay, well. I mean, it's fine. We are so close to 150 sacks of Dark uh, Harvest, and then we can go in for way better one shots than Electrocute ever could have. I'm so excited for that. Send impact. Damn, bonus champion damage is a lot of extra damage. Holy crap. Okay, let's do this. Oh, we've done a lot of extra damage with it. Hmm. Are they going to really commit, though, to going for that? I don't think they're going to commit hard enough since we have Pantheon full health. We have our team coming in. But I need to ping them to, like, go... Oh, no. If they kill Pantheon... I'm gonna really regret not going top lane. Yeah, he's dead. It's too late anyways, they're just gonna take the turret. But had I gone top, I just assumed they'd be fine, but they got caught. This is weird. This is very uh, NA solo queue-like behaviors. But luckily, I think there's no chance to even consider going. Yeah, they're gonna all recall, they have to. That's, that's something at least. They're only going to take one turret. Alright, so close. We're almost at 150. 138 right now. I'm gonna shove. I'm just gonna take this as fast as possible. I'm gonna run down here. Oh, I'm gonna go for the kill into Jinx as well. Come on, Jinx! Please turn this corner. Yes, thank you for the free kill. Hell yeah, dude! And we have the Dark Harvest ready. 148, dude. We are so close to just having it forever. There's a cannon minion there. I think I'm gonna go for it. And there we go. 152. We have it forever. Let's kill them all. I hate you, Ezreal. He's literally doing so much damage. It's ridiculous. He's 9 and 3 support. Oh, that's really annoying. I have to be very careful then. I actually might have to go for like a Zonius or something because that is just obscene amounts of damage. See you later, dude. You, on the other hand, you're easy. Somehow the support has gotten more fed than the mid laner. You must be embarrassed. No, I'm just kidding. Holy burst, dude. That was like 700 magic damage right there. And that's the double kill. Let's go into Shroud to get there faster. Please don't kill me, turrets. Holy crap. We actually aced them for a second. Um, Let's run away. Let's run away. I'm on my way to here. Push that, thank you. Good plays, good plays. We're almost back to full health as well. Dark Harvest will be up in a second. And there we go, we are Dark Harvest ready to go. Is this warded though? I don't know. Oops, no, you reset. That's fine, you'll be up in a second. Dark Harvest is ready. I'm gonna kill Ezreal. Ezreal, it's your turn to die. And it's your time, turn to die as well. We are literally doing so much damage with Dark Harvest right now. 
It's do it's literally just doing 500 damage to each person. Oh my god. <laughs> We're at that point, guys. We're literally at that point of being invincible. Not invincible, but literally godlike damage. Like absolutely like actually godlike damage. Holy crap. And it works on turrets too, okay. I'll take it. That will be pretty useful. Just clear it out a little bit faster. Drop the ward over the wall. As long as we can get it at least halfway through, it'll automatically just teleport to the end of the wall. Wait, what? I have 5,000 gold? <laughs> what? Okay. Um, I guess we've just been a little caught up doing stuff and we didn't realize it. Um, but we have... No, no Mountain Drake, just red buff. They summon Rift? What? That's weird. I'm gonna go for a play here. I don't think this is warded. And if their tanks don't frontline or uh, face check me, I can go for the kill. Oh. I tried, but it's okay. I mean, there's not much we could do there. Maybe I auto attack and then Q auto E and kill one, but after that, I'm dead for sure. So, okay, if we're going for the Lich Bane now, guys, we are going... So much damage is going to be had. Um, actually, so much damage to the point where I really don't even think we need to build anymore right now. Like, I could just go for a Dead Man's right here and be really safe about it. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do, just because they literally have 5 AD, uh, 2 Bruisers, and then 2 AD carries. I think we're going to do that. Get a Dead Man's here, and then um, for a final item, I'm thinking Zonia's Hourglass. Just a really good option, but... We could even get it now, really. Maybe now would be better. Yeah, we'll go for the Zonias now, actually. It just makes more sense, probably. At least if we play better, because there's a lot of pros to having dead mans, especially the stats, but the movement speed is nice, like really nice to catch their Ezreal out. So that's all I'm worried about. His his damage is absurd. And they got Baron, okay. I guess we should be worried about that. I'm coming, I'm coming. This is really good that he's distracting them. I'm, I'm, I'm predicting a triple kill for me. kidding yeah they're gone wait maybe not though maybe I can kill this Amumu so much damage dude I hate that guy I hate him so much I can't wait for him to lose this game I will make him lose guys we will make him lose Take the blue really quick. We're at 248, 250 stacks. 250 guys. Like, wow. Wow, 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 this burst. Um, I really want Jinx to just like try and push mid and have me one shot her with my Gunblade ult auto. I don't even need to proc my Q. With the amount of damage we have right now, I really don't think. Nice, they don't know I'm in here. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I'll see you later, dude. <laughs> How long does that sweeper last, man? Okay. I think we need to just go for, like, multiple turrets. I'll, uh, I'll split. I have the power to. I can 1v4. Please go away. I, I seriously beg you, dude. Like... Ay, ay, ay. I have I have the kills and the damage, the pressure. It's not about the ult. Ooh, barely dodged that. Oh my god. Damn it. Oh, so close to living through that. If I didn't get oh man. I actually maybe could have lived through that if I could have gotten auto off to heal. But, I mean, we distracted three. We got something, right? I think we got a turret. Maybe. Alright, I'm pretty sure we won that. Damn it. This is not good. What? Did he flash? 
What was he gonna do after that? He didn't have any damage. All right, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, this Ezreal is a huge problem. Um, I'm going Guardian Angel. I think that's gonna be the best option at this point since we've gone so tanky, or so uh, glass cannon heavy. I think GA is just better since it's more guaranteed to keep us alive or you know save us rather. Anyways, this guy's dead. Like I'm gonna hit him with the Gunblade right now. Yeah, GG. <laughs> Okay, Pan, can you just go top? Can you just... I know he has his ult and everything. I'm too glass cannon to group. Two hundred and seventy-six stacks. I'm gonna go ahead and mute this guy. He's an idiot. No, I have dark harvest stacks. Let me get that. Thank you. He knows. He knows. All right. We can honestly just one-shot this entire inhib. Not one-shot, but we have some insane damage for it. Um, too extended. He's gonna get killed by a Mumu. I'm, I'm really surprised Mumu didn't go for that. Hell yeah, Twitch, get that, dude. Get that. Okay, that's two inhibs. That's two inhibs. That's really good. I'm actually gonna go top right now. I wanna see if I can just kill this Jinx. She seems to be alone. I Like, she seems split enough. Alright. Just gonna spam this. Get ready. There we go. It's a triple kill. I think it's over now. Oh my god. Most troll. Most troll freaking mid laner and top laner in my life, but. <laughs> no, seriously though. It's okay. We won. GG well played, especially to Ezreal. Um, Alright, Akali Jungle Season 8. Not bad. So I did. I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new. And I'm out. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all in a new video. Peace.